industry, like the healthcare industry is being attacked now at unprecedented levels. In fact, we're gonna see a 125% increase in the number of tax to the healthcare industry over the next five years. The reason why is because healthcare information is worth 10 times your credit card or banking information on the black market. They can only use your credit card information one time before that gets stopped, so that's a one-time hit of maybe a couple thousand dollars. Mm. Your insurance card, a social security number can be used over and over and over again. And that is why healthcare information is so important to be protected. So many times addictive treatment centers hide underneath the blanket of part two and say that they don't have to comply with HIPAA, and that's not true. The last substantive update to CFR, or 42 CFR part two was in 1987, prior to the internet, prior to HIPAA, that, so 42 CFR part two right now does not address electronic records. They've actually, last week, um, proposed some new revisions that will address electronic records and hopefully those will be being um, passed hopefully the end of this year, maybe early next year. But until then, it is very important that you understand that if you are using electronic records, if you, have, if you are in any way transmitting electronic health information that you do have to comply with with HIPAA um, if you meet some of the other criteria but even if you don't meet the criteria of a covered entity as defined by HIPAA the, your state rules have or your state laws have regulations on how you can actually transmit that so you need to be looking and seeing what you need to do and like moreover too so many people are like I'm compliant I'm compliant I'm compliant and so they're taking the, the mentality of compliance over security or privacy, and I think that's a very dangerous mindset. You have to try to make yourself have a culture of, of security and a culture of privacy over compliance. You'll achieve compliance if you're trying to achieve security. If you're trying to achieve compliance, you will never achieve security. Does that make sense? It, so.